Alright then, so here we have Gouldron versus Hot Dog on Stormkeep. So Hot Dog going to start off by grabbing the Electro, picking up that Mega Health and heading off around to see if he can spot Gouldron, who is over there having picked up the Mega Armor. Now with the Vortex, waiting, hearing. Here's Gouldron come around that corner, wants to get away. That portal there, not a door, so of course, going to have to wait. Bit of a weird mouse spaz from Hot Dog, but it's alright. There we go, first fight comes out. Hot Dog doing some quite clever tactics to jump up and down. And should be able to pick up this armour and then go back over and maybe grab the Mega Health. But I think it indeed has gone. Both items at the same time right now. And both players at about the same armour and health stack. This isn't exactly the, what I'd call the most equal fight. But... Seems to be playing out alright so far. Neither player massively going ahead of either other. So, you never know. I'm just going based off of non-duel, really. Going based off of TDM. So, don't know. First blood, though, goes to Hot Dog. And seems like second's going to go straight off. Now, what's going to happen next? Gouldron, very nice mid-air rocket, exploded on the target. Triple kill. And it's a third frag for Hot Dog. Pulling ahead now, good stack. Beautiful shot there, followed up by a nice little rocket to finish the job. Gouldron's going to have to try and get some armour and find some way... To keep himself in this game. With Hot Dog picking up all the major items. And it looks like he's going to get the Mega 2 in a second. Oh no, he's going. He's actually moving away. Catches Gouldron off the corner. Doesn't connect with that rocket. But manages to pick up a nice little bit of damage from the rail. And now it's a very close fight. Smashing into each other. The Mega Health is up and the Mega Armor going soon. And there's the Mega Health actually going to Gouldron. So Gouldron in a very good position to take it right now. But Hot Dog moving out of the way. Five frags in the lead. Playing it slightly more careful now. Knows he's got the lead and knows that all he's got to do to keep it is keep on top of the items. As long as you get one of the items, you should be alright. Six seconds to the Mega. And there it is, and another six seconds to the Mega Armor. Very nice mid-air rocket right there. Very cleanly taken. And now Gouldron should be able to pick up this Mega, but just doesn't manage to get it. And that's really going to set him back here. Does manage to get the armor, though. But with only the Crylink to do anything with, it's not looking the best. And there's the connection yet again with the rocket launcher. The finisher seems to be the rocket launcher here. Very good armor. Very good damage. Rocket launcher and Vortex is the only weapons actually being used here by Hot Dog. Which is kind of the same as how I play. Uh, except I use the mortar instead of the devastator. But the, some of the blaster tricks to bounce up, it's pretty good. Pretty good positioning. Knows where he is. Heard him there. But going to get away. And ooh, that just skims over the head of Gouldron. Not going to make any connection. And now Hot Dog hasn't entirely got the position. Sees him up by the rocket launcher. And tries to get a bit of damage in. But Gouldron is having none of it. Gets a nice little shot off himself. And isn't taking any damage so far. Gets hit by one rail. Going to now need to put something into it. Mega Health is up, and it should go to Hot Dog. Gouldron pegged in the corner again and again and again, and taken out. Mega Armor up. Gouldron gets it. 
With only the blaster to go with, though. Low. Oh, beautiful tracking over with that rocket launcher. Very clean. And there we go. Gouldron manages to get a kill. But Hot Dog gets the kill first, actually, because that was the massacre. Ten kills without dying. Otherwise, he wouldn't have got the massacre. Which would have been just pretty good play from Gouldron to bring that back there. Four and a half minutes left to go. Gouldron still with a chance at this. Still very much with a chance, especially if he's going to play like this. Being able to pick up those items without taking too much. Only actually taking one sort of full. I think it was 71 damage rail. Now able to get into a position to deal some good damage. That was very good damage from Gouldron. And now Hot Dog couldn't see. But Gouldron blows himself up with the Electro. Which is going to put him back down on zero. Going to put Hot Dog into a very good position. With the Mega Armor coming up in two seconds. It looks like Gouldron's going to go down. Have the Mega Armor taken. And then the Mega Health as it comes up now. There it is. Goes to Hot Dog and Gouldron might just go down here. Yep. Yeah. Direct air shot. Very, very clean. Gouldron helping with that by running into the right position for it. Bit too early for that. Seven seconds still to go. One health left and there it goes. Up comes the armour. But actually it's going to be left. Going instead for that mega health. Very cleverly there. Can be taken and can be kept. Well, the good part of this game being that... Uh, the teleporters act like doorways. It can be confusing at first, when, especially on these sort of maps. Where you can shoot through and it, you effectively think that it's a door. You go around the side to try and get a better shot. And they're not there because it's a teleporter. So, you know, Gouldron picking up the armour, but possibly going to go down here. Very, very low, if not going down. And now it needs to stack up. Knows that Hot Dog's over by the Mega, so not going to push into there. Unfortunately, he gets caught out by a flying Hot Dog. But with a bit of health, actually going to be able to get away with it. Only took a little bit of damage there. And that rail missing. Not going to put in a good position. Trapped in that corner, but Hot Dog unable to connect with any of those shots. Quite low, but has managed to pick up the armor, so that's not going to be a bad at all. 100 100 for Hot Dog, 15 to nil in the lead. Two minutes left to go. It's not looking like Gauldron's going to be able to do very much, but a kill is still on the cards. After the five minute mark, the items have pretty much gone about 50 50. Gauldron has at least had time if he wants it. So. Could go a nice steal there from Gouldron. Should be able to pick up this kill here unless he can't land his shots. And that was a beautiful turnaround as Gouldron goes for the chase. Hot Dog is going to pick up the 17th kill. I was going to say 15th kill, but no. Miles off. Gouldron now trapped a bit in a corner. Going to take a rocket and a rail. It's not looking the best. Going down in the fire on minus one. Not the greatest of positions ever. And again, down. Hot dog now. Looking to push this lead up. Gets a 20 to one, minus one lead almost. 20, the score difference is what I meant to say there. Now, will Gouldron be able to pull it back in the last 40 seconds to take it? With the Mega Health being down for another 15 seconds, the Mega Armor being taken right now, 150, 150 stack. It's not looking the best of positions for Gouldron. He will possibly just be looking to survive for the rest of this time. Which could be a difficulty on about 20 health right now going into this fight. With a little bit of a stack. But should go down very, very low. 
Hot Dog doing some cheeky plays there. Finishes him off with the blaster and gets the next 10 kills. 20 to minus 1 the scoreline. Unfortunate for Gouldron with those two suicides, but GG.